What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Raven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we did a kind of like of a two-rounder over at the Jagged Pass because, yes, we forgot the Acro Bike. Yeah, it is needed there. So in this episode, we're going to be going straight for our fourth badge right here in Lava Ridge Town. Now, this Pokemon trainer is a Fire-type gym leader, so I brought along two Pokemon, you know, from our past... Just to get a little bit of experience and then, you know, we'll see what happens. I, I, I kind of want to see something right here. So, the only man that's ever believed in us is telling us, Yo, how's it going, ch champ to be Draven? Lava Ridge uh, Gym Leader Flannery uses Fire-type Pokemon. Her passion for Pokemon burns stronger and hotter than a volcano. Don't get too close to her or you will might get burned or hose her down with water and then go for it. Okay. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing right here. This place is like a, uh, a a sauna or something like that. And, you know, I'm going to go place to place to battle whatever trainer is around me. Because, well, the experience could prove useful right here. And this guy's telling me, yikes, it's hot. Yes, it is very hot. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Kindler Cole. That is a pretty cool name, Kindler Cole. Two Ks, I don't know. So we're gonna start off with Ole right here because, well, yeah, yeah, it, 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 it has the best chance of actually winning us a battle right here. Plus, it's at level 36, and there you go, Numel defeated, and a lot of experience points going to a lot of our Pokemon right here. And he's gonna be coming out with a Slugma, so let's just continue on what we were doing right here. And yes, Bubbly Beam. For the win! And just like that, Slugma is no more. Okay. Alrighty. Yeah. And in Shadow Eye, grows to level 27. So yes, yes, he is blinded by the sweat around here. I would hate to be in a gym like this because, well, it's... Yeah, like I said, it's pretty much a sauna right here. And, well, looks like to me... There is somebody waiting for us down there where you see the bubbles. And it's usually a person that's, you know, a ninja. So, let's go right ahead and take on Ninja Boy Hiromichi. Coming with his coughing. This guy right here is not afraid of what we're going to be going on here. And, yes, coughing could be a problem. So, let's go right ahead and switch it out. Let's go. I kind of do want to use Gyarados right here. That's why I switched out Thunderbolt. And here's Guy of the Fierce Knight going with the Trace and copying the Levitate. And this one right here, we're taking an Assurance attack right now. So here we go. Psychic attack for the win. And there we go. Just like that. Just like that. And, well, Ninja Boy Hirosh Hiromoshi getting... Yes. Ninja Boy getting defeated. So here we go, going back down. And like I said before, we're going to be battling as many people as possible. Hopefully, like, the strategy that I have it planned will work. Or maybe, I don't know. So here we go, taking on Kindler Axel. It's a pretty cool name, Axel. Axel Rhodes. And here we go with Ole. Ole is looking pretty good. And let's go straight for a Bubbly Beam attack right now. So, let's see. That takes care of Slugma. I am feeling great about that. And, well, Hydra grows to level 16. And that is exactly what we're trying to do. Yes, it might be a weak Gyarados, but it could help us right here. And, yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. Because, uh, holy crap baskets. Let's see. Let's go back up right here. And there we go. Look at that. Okay, so... Go ahead and talk to this lady right here, and very obvious that she has a like she has a fighting type Pokemon. And here we go, Battle Girl Sadie would like to battle with a Metatite right here. Alrighty, let's go with Ole. Now it's kind of messed up because we don't have a Water Stone right now. It won't be until later on, but I do have Water Stones over. You know, I might make a Mega Ruby walkthrough or playthrough or not not playthrough, but game. And that fire attack does not work. So let's go with an uproar. Yes, I'm using different kinds of moves now. Look at that. Uproar. That doesn't well, it's not that effective, but it defeats him. 
And just like that, we're getting some more points. Sadie doesn't like any of us. So, uh, yeah. Okay. So, let's do something crazy right here. Uh, let's go ahead and switch it out. Now, I do have Toxic Batman with me just in case. Probably should have used it right there and then, but let's go right down here on the second. And, yeah, we're definitely not going to find anything. This is just a trap. Holy crap. Okay, just like geysers. Gonna go right here, and the third one is usually the one. It's not like I didn't know, it's just, well, you, you guys know what I mean. So, here we are, and there should be a ninja guy ready, waiting for us. And he's gonna be like, hoo hoo, you left yourself open with ninjutsu, I will conceal myself into steam. I would like to learn that. I really would. Okay, so, Shochi is coming out with a coughing. Let's go, Hydra. Get some experience points. Yes, I am bringing out a freaking Magikarp. But guess what? We're going to be bringing out... Uh, you know what? Let's go, with, let's go with Shadow Eye right here. Because it does have moves due to its stall ability. So here we go. Shadow Eye. How's it going? Here comes a Flamethrower. Yeah, not that effective. Okay. So, because we got hit, here comes a Clear Smog. And that is not effective, but here comes the Metal Burst. Which only works, you know, it, it doubles up everything. So let's go with a Shadow Claw right here, and here comes a Sludge Attack. And, yeah, we're going to get hit pretty... Oh, look at that, we're poisoned, so this could be good. This is very good, because now that we're poisoned, we can, uh, we can use Facade. Facade would actually double, so hopefully we survive... So here we go. There's that. We survive. Here comes Facade. Since we're poisoned, it's it's just... It, it's ridiculous. Yes. There you go. And just like that, we get some more points. Toxic Batman grows to level 26. And there you go. We, we are victorious yet again. So now it is time to... Let's see. Let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. Let's go with this. Shadow Eye doing its thing. And do I have... Yes, I have a full heal right here. There you go. And... Let's go ahead and find some more Pokemon trainers. I want to find them all. Beat them all. Evolve Hydra. And we are literally right behind Flannery, so... Yeah. I think there's only a set amount of trainers, so... Yeah. I think that's what the, the whole thing is. So, we're going up to this location right here. And I think, yeah, we okay, we're, we haven't been here yet. So, here we go. Let's get it. Here we go with Zane, and here comes Slugma. And there you go, Slugma is coming out. And here comes Hydra. I kind of want to see something, but then I don't, because it would be a waste. So, let's go straight for Toxic to Batman. Give everybody a bit of a... Of a a, a bit of love right here. So here we go. Talk to Batman. How's it going? Here comes an overheat attack. As powerful as this move is, it harshly lowers the special attack of the user. And that is something that, well, that is something that is is pretty good for a one-time use. And there you go. Another overheat. So this one won't be as powerful as last time. So, bam. We get hit. Not so powerful. And... Now you're down four levels. Let's go! Air cutter attack. And the air cutter attack does its trick. There goes Slugma. And just like that. Yes. Holy crud, everybody's getting some points. And let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go back to Hydra. Now, again, I know it's pretty stupid that I'm doing this right now. Hell, Hydra might not even evolve at this episode. Yeah, it might not. So, look at this. Yeah, we got Kecleon. So, let's go to Tommy JDF. Let's go. Switch it out. Get some experience. Mooch it off. And then there we go. Tommy JDF. How's it going? Here comes a slash attack. And that right there hits us pretty good. So, let's go with a double kick attack. Hopefully, this defeats Kecleon. And there you go. Say goodbye to Kecleon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And... There's more experience points. Hydra grows to level 17. And Ace Trainer Zane has been defeated. 
So it looks like to me that Hydra will not evolve in this in this episode because I think we've defeated every single trainer here. So let's see, unless, unless you know, let's see. I got, I got one rare candy. So let's go right ahead and uh, well, let's hope for the best. I don't think it's gonna evolve. So, eh, one one can only dream, right? You must be getting tired by now. You'd like to rest uh, in a hot bath, eh? You should you should know uh, that maintaining your willpower is important ability for all traders. It is. But guess what? I have lots of that, and my Pokemon are pretty good, and, well, I do stock up on a lot of items, so, yeah. I'm okay. I am okay, guys. Okay, so, here we go. Take it on, or take it on, Numel. And, yes, we have no shot of beating this Pokemon, so, let's go with Oleg. And, huh. I'm only curious right here. Very, very curious. So, here comes Earth Power. And that doesn't hurt Ole very much. So let's go straight for a bubble beam. Quad damage. And just like that, Numel has been defeated. Alrighty. Okay. And Hydra gets some more points and bam. So yeah, it looks like Hydra will not evolve in this episode. What was the point of that, damn it? Uh, okay, so here we are going to the final stage. And that is to Flannery herself. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Again, to this day, Flannery is still the sexiest gym leader ever. There we go. There's another one. And then there's another one. Okay. Let's do this. Let's get this show on the road. And, uh, well, just because uh, it won't evolve, let's go with Olay right here and see what ends up happening right here. Mmm. Mm mm mm. Fine as wine. Mm mm mm. Why are you teasing me? There she is. Mm 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 mm. Welcome. Uh, she's yelling. Uh, no, wait. I mean, uh, puny trainer, you've done well to make it this far. Let's see. Um, uh, I'm honored uh, to be serving as gym leader of. Okay, so she <laughs> she must be new. No, I mean, I'm Flannery, and I'm here uh, to change here. Uh, can we just battle? Yeah. With the skills I inherited from my grandfather, I'm going to uh, demonstrate the hot moves we've honed in this land. Hiya! Okay. So here it is, guys, taking on mm, Flannery herself. Mm-mm-mm. Flannery. Oh, my God. To this day, yes, I still think she's the hottest gym leader. Quote me on that, yes. So here we go, take it on a Slugma, and yes, Ole will be taking the, the lead right here. Let's go with the Bubbly Beam. Yes, we're gonna be Bubbly Beam everybody. That's right, take that Slugma. How's it feel to fail? Not so good, not very good. And bam, we get to level 37 right here. And well, let's see, Hydro grows to level 18. What a waste. And level 38. So here comes a Torkoal. I think Ole can take care of all of this, so let's go. Ole, use Le Bubble Beam. And Le Bubble Beam does its trick. Say goodbye to Tarkoal. Yeah, that wasn't, uh, yeah, yeah, she, she's not really the best trainer ever. Shadow Eye mooching off the whole team. And here comes Numel. So, who, who's gonna tell her? Le Bubble Beam. For the win, and bam. Numel defeated. And, uh, yeah, she is not going to be happy. Oh, my God. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. Maybe you didn't try at all, because good God. I, I've, I've, re I've only recently become the gym leader. I guess I was trying too hard to become someone I'm not. When I don't act like myself, no wonder my Pokemon that, or the Pokemon uh, that battle at my side get confused. Thank you for teaching me that. You deserve this. And there it is, guys, throwing out the peace sign, asking for Flannery's number, or Instagram, or whatever you guys have for these days. We get ourselves the Heat Badge. If you have the Heat Badge, all Pokemon up to level 50, even those you get in trades, will obey you. And this lets you use the move Strength Outside of Battle. This is a token of my appreciation, so don't be shy of taking it. And there it is, guys. We get ourselves the TM50 uh, TM Overheat. 
So, Overheat is a fire type move that inflicts serious damage on target, but it also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokemon using it. It might not be suitable for longer battles. That is so true. Anywho, we are done with this place. We did not evolve Hydra. I feel like I kind of, you know, miscalculated some stuff, but still, it's the effort that counts. So, after coming out of the Lava Ridge Town Gym, mmm, 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 mmm. May is back, as I live and breathe, oh my god. Draven, wow, it's a relief to see you in one piece. Oh, well, you know, the last time I saw you, uh, I saw you was right after battling those Team What's-It's people. So I was worried, I was a bit worried, thinking about what might have happened to you. She likes me. She knows it. She wants me. And well, yeah, after that. What? You battle uh, them again after that? And you beat them? You really are something else, Draven. I, I mean, you you and your team are. I'm pretty impressed by you all. And that pretty stone, that pretty stone that's sparkling there, is it? Is that the meteorite that got that you got back from them? Yes, I did. Oh, that's right. Here, here. I've been thinking of giving you these. Uh, she gives us the Go Go goggles, which can be used for the desert right around Route 111. And uh, well, she's like, oh. And isn't that the Lava Ridge Gym Badge? So you beat Flannery too. I guess you really are training to, uh, your Pokemon right. Next up is challenging your dad Norman in the Pedalburg uh, Gym, right? I'm headed to Pedalburg's Gym right now. Do you want to go back together, back to Pedalburg? Yes, I do. Okay, so we are headed back to Pedalburg because, well, we got another Gym Badge waiting for us right here. Mmm. It's time. Well, we made it. Pedalburg City Gym. Good luck on taking on uh, the gym leader, Draven. Or, gym leader, Draven. I'm cheering for you. Yes, you are. So, here we are, guys. Back home. Well, kind of. In the next episode, we will be challenging our father for our fifth gym badge. This is going to be pivotal because after winning the gym badge right here, everything opens up. And I cannot wait because we're going to be doing a lot of stuff off screen just to get things ready. So thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for waiting and being patient as always. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. See you guys.